What's up guys? Welcome back to the Master Chef. <laughs> <laughs> so I've been obviously showing you a couple of meat dishes and I've had a few people message and say you've forgotten about the vegetarians. So I haven't forgotten about the vegetarians. Today I'm gonna make a vegetarian dish. Yeah. And um, I'm gonna make chana masala. So chana masala is basically chickpeas or garbanzo beans, is it babe? Garbanzo beans, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's chickpeas. It's basically chickpeas, chickpeas yeah. And I'm going to use uh, tin chickpeas because obviously they're already soft. Mm. So it doesn't take a long time. You don't have to soak them or nothing. They're already done. So I've already uh, drained them and, wa and washed them. Yeah. Chickpeas, guys. There you chickpeas go. is so nice. Hey, I was still looking. Oh, sorry. <laughs> there you go. Good job. I've got a demanding camera person here. No, man. Yeah, I'm under pressure now. <laughs> so anyway, focus. today, not only am I making vegetarian food, I've also got my legs out. See? Woo! For the ladies. <laughs> anyway. Okay, so let's start anyway. Now for the legs. Stop looking at the legs. Okay, okay. <laughs> um, they're actually a little bit ashy, man. I should have, I should have actually moisturised. <laughs> okay, so what am I doing now? You got me all confused and flustered now. What the hell? I didn't right. say nothing. <laughs> so yeah, um, yeah, so we're doing chickpeas today, guys. So anyway, right. We're going to start with um, Our the standard. Um, right, before yeah. I begin, I, you know, before, I, I would never cook. And then yeah. when Prim learned how to cook off a friend, and I found out it was this easy, I thought, wait a minute, I need to get in on this. Yeah. Because this is easy, Because it's so right? simple. So anyway, like, when, the special ingredient, again, is a packet of chana masala. Yeah. So this has got all the ingredients ground down. So I'll show you the packet. All the ingredients are already ground down for you, so you don't have to do anything. Mm -hmm. You just need to know the quantity to put in. Yeah. So that's the chana masala, and that's really important, you need that. And then the main basic mix is the same. Hello, What's up, monkey boy? What do you want? No, hey, we've got a guest. Okay, okay, Finn, daddy's cooking. Okay, buddy. <laughs> what are you doing? Mommy, I love your big thing. Thank you very much. You love mommy's big thing. Okay, Finn, be a good boy. Go sit down and play with Javi, okay? I'm making okay. you some dinner. And then I'm making you some dinner, otherwise we're not going to eat any dinner today. Yeah. Bye bye. Bye bye. Be a good boy now, okay? Hello. Oh my God. Oh my God. He's gonna slam that door. So, so we've got um, the chana masala packet, which is important. We've got a tomato tin, which I've already opened up. Uh, ginger and garlic. So five garlic uh, cloves, uh, cubes, and um, some ginger. Uh, ginger again, about that much. Okay. Uh, fresh tomato and red onion. I've only chopped up half a red onion. So that's going to go in at the end. Mm -hmm. um, turmeric powder, salt, garam masala again, yeah? And my cooking onions that we're going to start with. Okay. Cool. Mm -hmm. So we're going to chuck the oil in. Again, I'm only going to use two tablespoons of rapeseed oil. This is cold pressed. So it's actually unfiltered. the better version, isn't it, baby? Yeah, it's unfiltered. Isn't it? And then we heat the oil up. So we're going to put the heat on. Okay, and we're just going to make sure it starts, uh, it's nice and hot before we put the onions in. Is that on high heat, yeah? That's on high heat. I'm just heating the oil up. Cool. And uh, make sure you've got uh, some uh, boiling water right. in the kettle, ready to go, just in case you need to keep it moist so the onions don't burn. Yeah. Someone because, said that was a really good trick that you told them yeah, about because, the water instead yeah. of putting oil. Yeah, because why, you're just fattening your food up. I want yeah. my food to be healthy. Yeah. You know what I mean? And I'm sure everyone else does as well. Exactly. And, and they don't tell you that. Because if you look at half the cookery programs, they're sticking in like deep fry. It's like loads of oil. Oh, it's like exactly. a deep fry. It's too much. Stuff. Yeah, it's too much. Why do you want to deep fry my curry? Yeah, <laughs> do you know I deep fry it. Yeah, it doesn't make sense, right? <laughs> yeah. So let that heat up. Uh huh. And uh, yeah, I am actually becoming a very good cook. I'm becoming better because I'm filming for you guys. <laughs> That's what it is, isn't it? What do you think, babe? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Because like, you're actually talking it through and having to think it through for someone who doesn't know how to do it. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. I, I mean, I hope that you guys are finding it easier. Yeah. Because, as I said, when I started, I didn't realise it was this easy. Yeah. Because I thought, oh, I've got to put in cardamom pods, I've got to put in cinnamon stick. Yeah. Well, oh, I can't be it looks so complicated, doesn't yeah. it? And then I've got to use this and that. Yeah. I've got to heat up some cumin seed before. Yes. You know what I mean? But you don't have to. And how long is it all going to take? I'm going to chuck the onions in now, guys. So we're going to make them golden brown. Same process as the rest as before. So that was uh, the onions. We used one and a half onions. Oh, sorry. One and a half? Two and a half. Oh, two and a half onions. Two and a half onions. Yeah. Just so you know the amount. 
I'm going to turn the heat slightly down so it's not too high. Mm-hmm. About medium heat. And we just want to make it golden brown mm-hmm. again. I'm using a non-stick wok, so it'll probably not. You okay. won't have to use much boiling water because it shouldn't really stick. Thank you. Yeah. So how is your day been today? Yeah, all right. Yeah. Again, I've been to work and Primo's chucked me straight into the kitchen, but oh hey ho, God. I'm used to slave labour. <laughs> I thought slavery was over, but no. no. Once you get married, no. it starts all over again. <laughs> you know what I mean? Hey, it was your day to cook anyway. Yeah. yeah. You know what? I'm really glad that everyone likes my cooking. Yeah, yeah. I'm actually glad yeah. you do as well. I think everyone's quite surprised that. That you can cook. Yeah, and not only that, like I said, it's not hard. It's easy. It's not hard. It's man. really easy. You know what I mean? Yeah, it's definitely easy. So, um, yeah, other than that, my day's been easy. Yeah. I can't complain. It's been a good day. Yeah. But how come every time I cook, the weather is sucks? It's t- typical. It's been raining Look. all day. No, 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 no. I mean, it's like, oh, it's just no, crazy like, every time something. he cooks. I was actually saying to Jazz earlier that you know what, babe? Yeah. Because every time you're cooking, it's raining, and obviously you've seen the videos when I took the kids out and we were playing at the yeah, pond, you're really lucky. at the fountain. So in about three days, where the weather was nice, yeah. And then all of a sudden, boom, it's raining again. Yeah, so I was yeah. saying, Jazz, you know what? I need to go on holiday just mm. to get consistent one week consistent warm weather yeah because i can't deal with this weather Definitely. anymore no, we, yeah. we should but you know that day guys by the way i wasn't in that video because i had a night shift at work oh yeah 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 so every now and again we are up to do like six night shifts a year and it actually dropped on that day and it was yeah. a really nice day exactly so i said to primo look why don't you just go out with the kids yeah because you and let the kids have day. some fun because I can't really do anything, yeah. I need to get my sleep, exactly. my beauty sleep, you know what I mean? I don't look this good. It, it's not, it's looking this good don't just happen easily, right? You've got to sleep. I love this my sleep. sleeping beauty. Yeah, I'm a proper sleeping beauty, isn't it? I'm in bed with the kids by about 7.30, I'm, I know. So, I'm, I'm just so, so I know. bad. Yeah, I know. And, and I'll get like phone calls and texts with my mates, like, what? guys, are you falling asleep again? Yeah. Like, yeah. Yeah. I, don't want, I can't be bothered with TV sometimes, I just think, nah, I'm going to bed, man. The kids yeah, but asleep. babe, you get up at 4.30 in the morning, so, yeah. seven. 7.30 is about right. Yeah, I don't even I don't even beat around the bush. I tell people straight. Yeah. I actually love my sleep. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. And once I've been to the gym, I'm shattered. Mm. So those three days that I go to the gym, I'm definitely going to be going to sleep. Oh, yeah, exactly. But yeah, yeah, back to the holidays, we definitely need to get back on that. Yeah, the kids haven't been uh, on holiday yet. So me and Jess were talking. Yeah. Uh, because obviously I'm not working at the moment, so money is not yeah. free flowing. No, it's not. Yeah. It's not exactly so, abundant. Um, yeah. So, like, we're usually always good at making our money go far, aren't we? We're yeah, really good. Yeah, yeah. Like, with everything we do, we're not we're not spending frivolously, are we? And we're sensible with how we book stuff as well. Yeah, long. we're very good at, you know I mean? at things like that. I mean, I've been quite lucky because Primrose has let me go away with my friends a few times. Yeah. One of my best friends got married last year in uh, New Jersey. Yeah. So I had to... Um, go there plus i had to go hungry because uh, bachelor's week yeah so we went away for about five days i think it was yeah it was it was quite okay. and um yeah i mean when we went to new york i used uh i was quite clever because I, I said to guys like and even the guys were saying to me let's not waste money in the hotel no let's get an apartment yeah so we ended up getting an apartment right in the meatpacking chelsea district chelsea area yeah what street was it on uh 14, 14th street west i think it was 14th street. Uh, right, it was right in the uh, meatpacking right and it only cost us 200 quid each between uh four of us i think it was near enough how long did you go for it five nights so five nights or two yeah. quid each in new bed. york city Come in on, center man. central in yeah so and that was through a website called home away Okay. And it's got a really good app on your iPhone or your Android. Uh-huh. And uh, I, I found it was really reliable. I even spoke to the owner before I went. Yeah. You know what I mean? Mm. And I used a like, safe payment. I just find it's better. Yeah. And it felt like being at home, didn't it, babe? Okay. Uh, then you find that home. Of course. You, you yeah. Like, uh, I usually use Airbnb when I go away with my friends and stuff. And, um, and for Airbnb, I just think it feels so much better than being in a hotel because you just feel more at home you feel like you're experiencing mm. the country a bit yeah. better isn't it you did and that i think you you did that when you went to the states in 2014 didn't you? yeah i went i came to the states to do like a random acts of kindness it was like a project yeah. that i did for five acts wasn't it yeah five today yeah so i did um i can't remember how many days i did but i, I traveled was, all around i think it was about three weeks wasn't yeah. it? yeah 
exactly. So I traveled around all through America. I went to t 10 different states in America. I went to Canada, I went to Bahamas, and... Toronto. Yeah, went to Toronto, yeah, Canada. And then the West Coast as well, San Diego, LA, yeah. California, wasn't it? Yeah. Uh, all around there. So I, I got to experience like Airbnb quite well, and then... Um, I'll let you carry on, yeah. but now I'm going to add the uh, five cloves of uh, garlic chopped yeah. finely, and the ginger chopped finely. Yeah. And we're going to cook that for another three minutes, uh -huh. like we normally do. Yeah. And yeah, so you So yeah, so uh, Airbnb was brilliant. So I was saying to Jazz, uh, because the kids haven't been on holiday yet, uh, we need to take them away. And so we're yeah, going to... Abby would be like, I think Abby would, Havana would lose her mind. She would, she's so asking. She Can I go here? Can I... We wanted to go to, uh, to Cuba for Havana's first holiday, um, because... Mm. Because obviously she's named Havana after yeah, the capital. City, yeah. <laughs> yeah, but it's just it's just so expensive to do that. I'm gonna add some water in because it's getting a bit uh, dry now. Smells good, guys. Yeah. When do you cook this? I think you're gonna really like it. Yeah. Yeah. So uh, yeah, we were thinking, weren't we, about doing Cuba? Yeah. So we think about doing Cuba, but. It's like £3,000 just for the flight on their crazy. own before yeah. you even have spending money or anything. So we're going to go Europe just we can as well. We just short trips, can't we? Yeah, yeah we're probably yeah. going to... Actually, because you guys are saying that you're enjoying seeing Windsor and you're enjoying like like the days out that we're doing. So we might do a couple of trips in Europe just to... Um, yeah, because just it's like short trips for the kids. You're not flying for hours yeah. and hours. And you can do like seven days and it won't cost you an arm and a leg either. Exactly. And if you Airbnb it as well, oh, it's yeah, like yeah, virtually... Yeah. Great deal. Oh, it's and really good. And right on the beach. You'd exactly. be surprised that. It's so central. Yeah. Like Airbnb is amazing. I love mm. it. Mm. Or, um, if it's still end turning out to be really expensive to do, do Airbnb, mm. you might do house swap. Yeah, yeah. Um, house swap is obviously... The people come and stay in your house, and yeah. you go and stay in their house. So I never knew about that. I know, I know. Yeah. <laughs> See, I'm good at saving money. I'm very, I'm very like a. You're very clever about that. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I don't like wasting I money just I was for no. No, no. <laughs> <Tight one>. but, <laughs> I don't like wasting money just for no reason. I'd rather have more experiences cool. than so, just luxury. Babe, now I'm gonna um, add in the tomato tin. The tomato cool. tins. So the tomato tin's gonna go in. Yeah. One tin of uh, chopped tomatoes, yeah. but as I said, you can use plum tomatoes, it doesn't really matter, as long as you squash the, uh, the tomatoes out. Yeah. And now we're going to cook this for about 5 to 10 minutes, mm. until it's thickened, put the lid on, yeah. and at that point, put the heating I'll, put, or? Yeah, I'll put the heat back onto medium heat, yeah. so just medium heat, guys, oh. medium, medium heat, so it doesn't burn, you don't want to burn it basically. Yeah. So if it's medium to, to medium high, it's okay. Just mm. keep an eye on it, keep stirring it every yeah. couple of minutes. Yeah. Yeah, so we might do mm. a house swap, mm. and that's free, and that affords us to be able to do a couple of more holidays with the kids, especially before Havana starts um, preschool in September, because by then we won't be able to go anywhere really as much. Actually, because it's guys, expensive. I'm also going to add the garam masala and the turmeric now, because I want it to cook a little bit, so I put the chana masala in. Yeah. So we're going to use a teaspoon of garam masala. Okay. So we do that. Uh -huh. Just one teaspoon. One teaspoon of garam masala and half a teaspoon of turmeric. Okay, just show it in. Turmeric. Cool. The cool. magic antiseptic yeah if you have spots on your face or anything like that you can uh, put this into a paste and it kills uh, the spots uh, we'll, so. add, we'll add the salt in as well actually yeah go for it. so i'm going to do uh one and a half teaspoons mm -hmm. just be and sure to show it to me one and a half cool because you don't want to make it too salty. No. You can always add, but you can't yeah, take it out. Yeah, you can't take it out. <laughs> so mix that up. So I'll just look at the clock quickly. Yeah, so we'll do 10 minutes of that. Jazz is very good at keeping an eye on the timer and stuff like I'm that. I'm really I particular never about... I'm very methodical, aren't I? I he is. Yeah. I just like guesstimate, free, um, mm. freestyle everything. But I think a lot of women are like that anyway. 
Because we're always in a hurry. We're always in a hurry yeah. to cook dinner because guys don't really cook, cook a lot. Yeah, exactly. We don't really cook that yeah. much, do we? And when you cook, you enjoy it because it's like an art for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whereas like I do it like five days a week, whatever, and it's just like Look how good quick, that quick, looks. quick. It looks so good. It already smells great. Yeah. Oh man, I can't wait to eat this. So guys, I'm going to stick the lid on now. And what we'll do, we will come back once we're ready to add the chana masala and the chickpeas. Okay. So the chana masala packet. That's the good <laughs> stuff. Yeah. And the chickpeas. Nice. And then we'll show, tell you what to do next. Yay. Yum, yum. <laughs> yum. I'll see you in a bit. See you in, in 10 minutes. So yeah, so guys, if you've got anywhere in Europe that you want to see, uh, let us know because a couple of you have said that you're far away in America and there's places you want to come and see in Europe and you mm. can't. So if there's anywhere you want to go and see, let us know and we'll actually consider doing a trip there. Yeah. And also, if you're in Europe uh, and you've got recommendations of places for us to go and see that you think are amazing, let us know yeah. and we definitely consider those ones because we're looking at recommendations because mm. uh, it just makes it easier, isn't it, when we've got yeah. the kids. It's nice when someone's already told you what's good and you're yeah. kind of already aware of what exactly. is out there with the it's kids. It's like, yeah, it? if you message me like, what's good yeah. in Windsor, I can say, go to this restaurant, it's amazing, That's it, go yeah. and see the guards, go and do this, you're going to save money, you don't need to like spend a lot of money. And whereas if you're going to come as a tourist, you're not going to know that stuff. Windsor's actually a really good night out as well. That's what people have to oh, remember. There's a lot of nightclubs. There is loads of the, nightclubs in and bars. Windsor. So if you're into like yeah. hitting clubs and bars, it's worth visiting yeah. Windsor for one night. Yeah, because people just think like Windsor is a bit snooty and stuff no, like that. No, no, no. But the nightlife in the town centre is amazing. There's oh, loads yeah. and loads and loads of bars. So yeah, so if you've got somewhere for us to go, let us know. If you're in Europe, let us know where we can visit. I mean, I'd like to go to Amsterdam, but people are like, mm. Mm. And Apparently Dam's, Dam's supposed to be really good. I know, like, I, like, I was I can't, reading yeah. about it today and I was looking mm. at Airbnb for prices and stuff like that. Mm. It was actually good. It was reasonable. Sweden I want to go to and there's like a lot of places mm. like Milan, obviously a bit too expensive. But yeah, if you've got places in Europe, definitely. Let us know. Yeah, push in the Cheap comment family section. holidays. Yeah, yeah, nothing <laughs> Please, lavish because obviously I am not working at the moment. Yeah. I'm just a bum at home. We're just waiting for her to start <laughs> working, basically. I do have a job, though. Yeah, you just need to wait for your training dates. Yeah, I have got a job that's going to start up soon. But they um, make you hang around. Yeah, so they're doing all the stick security checks as they do. And uh, and so, yeah, so I'll be back to work soon. So the so, vlogs will be going down. <laughs> so, honey, we're going to have to go back to the dinner yep, now. Yeah, let's right, go. So I'm going to flip this. No problem. Ten minutes are up and I've let's been... See. Ten Let's minutes are up looking. and I've been stirring it. Yeah. So I'm just gonna look look how thick it's getting. Nice. You see? So I've been stirring it every couple of minutes just to make sure it doesn't burn. Yeah. You don't want it to So stick. I've done it's been about eight minutes now. Yeah. On medium to medium heat, right? Mm-hmm. So now we're gonna add the chickpeas. I'm gonna boil the water up again because we need a full cup of water. So I'm gonna add the chickpeas in. And I'm gonna put in the chala masala. Mm -hmm. The special ingredient, guys. Yeah. Let's show you again. This is not like the MDH masala, this is a different one. But I'm sure MDH do one as well. Yeah. Chenna masala. But this is one I usually buy. So this is one Primrose yeah. is bought. When I got taught how to do um, Indian food, <clears throat> the girl who was teaching me showed me this masala. And from then on, I've just been faithful to it. Um, so when you're putting it in, show, show it to me. Okay. So you Go see that's in the way. So wanna, I'm not going to use that much. I'm going to use level tablespoon, right? I can see that. Actually, I'll put a bit more. Make sure it's tasty. Yeah. You see that? Yes. And I'm just going to sprinkle that in. If you want to put more, you can, but I think that's enough. I'll put a little bit more. There you go. So that's a tablespoon of uh, chana masala. Can you smell it, guys? Can you smell so you that what in? jazz is cooking, huh? <laughs> Can you smell what the jazz is cooking? cooking? Oh, yeah. yeah, when you put the spices in, it's just like... Oh. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna add half a cup of water, then we're gonna cook it for about... Baby, is it about 10 or 15 minutes? No, 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 10 minutes. 10 because minutes. Because the chickpeas are already cooked. Because they've come out of a tin, which yeah. the way they're already... So you're not really, you're just flavoring them, if yeah. anything. So, yeah. so no, it's not. So look at that. Mm. So I'm gonna add half a cup of water. Need a cup. Need a cup. Of boiling water, yeah? There you yeah. go, guys. Half a full cup, sorry, not half a cup. Full cup of boiling water. Full cup of boiling water. Look at that. Stir it up, stir it up. Stir that up so that it's nice and 
mixed in, all the yeah. juices are everywhere. That's it. That's looking good. All you vegans and all you uh, vegetarians out there, see? I see. It can you be need done. to find a guy like me. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I did say no. in the last video I do husband training services. Yeah, so she trained this. I didn't even know how to even. Yeah. I couldn't even tie my shoelaces. <laughs> 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 no, he didn't know your way in the kitchen. No, I didn't. Because know. his mum did everything, so Yeah, that's a lot of Indian guys are like that. Yeah. That's just like an Indian thing. Exactly. Like I said, don't go in the kitchen, I'll make it. I'll for make you. it. Sit for down, you. you're already halfway yeah. through cooking it and it's like, yeah. okay, carry on then. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? So so with Jazz I was like, you know what? Look we need that. to work that as a team. Awesome now, it, it looks really nice, <laughs> yeah. So we started working as a team, isn't it really? Mm -hmm. And we share like now he's cooked today. Yeah. That means I have to wash up. Yeah, and when you're gonna be washing up, yeah. Yeah, and and when I cook, he washes up. Yeah. So we take it in turns, like just swap. He wash up, I cook. So that way, everyone gets enough mm. time to rest and downtime mm. and time together because the job is Definitely. done in half the time, isn't it? Yeah. So, I mean, I'll just quickly say with this. Uh, now that I put the water in, we're gonna cook it for ten minutes, and you're gonna just stir every couple of minutes. Oh, yeah, keep the lid on. To stick keep to the, the lid on. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. And yeah, you're right. That, but at the end of the day, you've got to work like a team. Exactly. We're yeah. working like a team. Yeah. Because, because I think it's important. Because don't get me wrong, I've lapsed, and you've told me off. <laughs> I've bucked my ideas up again. Exactly. But I think it's... that all comes down to uh, will we? I mean, we're going to do a video on do we argue? Yes. And yeah, I think yeah, that all comes down to that, and that's up. that's definitely more of a relationship video. Yeah. Like what we found over our near enough seven years, almost married. Exactly. What we had to discuss before, and what we had to discuss during. During, yeah. 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 So we'll go over all that. Anyway. And I think it's a it when when the kids see Jazz helping out and Mummy doing stuff. Yeah. They it's want a, to help out because they realise that mm, everybody has to chip in. It's a good example for Phoenix as well. Yeah, exactly. Because it's he important. needs to see that. Wait a minute. Yeah. Dad is helping out. He is doing his exactly. Fair share. Yeah. So how if they ask me to, I must do it. Exactly. And it's good adult. already. Yeah. It's good, isn't it? Like yeah. if you tell it, if they tidy up your toys, yeah. he tidy up they his toys. It. They're yeah. very good. His so sister just... his sister covers his butt though, doesn't she really? Yeah, she does more of the work. When he doesn't do it, she yeah. does all of it. But when she's at nursery, Finn does it himself. Because I won't go and help him. Mm. I'm like, you you made a mess, you tidy up. Good. Exactly. Good. And he knows. Now he's just like, ding, 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 chuck him. I finished, close your eyes, come and see. Good. He gets so excited. Good, yeah. Yeah. I think you're doing a great job with him. Yeah. yeah. You know that. It's it, it's just good because yeah. when they're older and teenagers, you, you don't, don't then start to. asking them, oh, can you help me? And it's like, well, <laughs> but that's when they want to that's, that's when you, you get, that's when Plushing. you want to argue and yeah. say, wait a minute, you don't, like I said, wait a minute, you don't make me, you never made me do it, made me do it before. before. Why are you, Why are you me asking me now? Yeah. And then you're like, oh my God, really? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Like, so I'm supposed to like be your maid. Yeah. And it happens in everyone's house. Of course it does. There's always one kid that doesn't do it. Yeah, of course, yeah. You know what I mean? And then like now, they're already fighting me. Can we wash up? Can I wash up my bowl? Can I? Yeah. And I'm just like, oh. <laughs> but got, you know what you just let them. I got I got a five minute video of Javi uh, washing up dishes. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It, might might, be, might it might be worth posting it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. And even Finn, he likes. He comes in and oh, can I can wash it. up my bowl. Because he's copycat, isn't he? Exactly. But it's yeah. good. It's good. Because yeah. then that way they they know they need to clean up after themselves, isn't it? Yeah, that'd yeah, no, be good. Yeah, I'm just gonna put the heat yeah, back up to medium. Yeah. Yeah. So the heat's on medium, guys. No worries. Just so you know. Let's have a look. I'm gonna be. It's quite a big hob, but I'm putting. It, let's say medium. Yeah, but the pot medium. is really big. The pot's big as well. Yeah. So yeah. Because I I want to make sure that in that ten minutes is cooked. Yeah. And what I'm what I'm gonna do after five minutes, I'm gonna put in a bunch of coriander. Mm-hmm. And then mix that in, and then at the end, uh, and then in another say couple of minutes or five minutes later, so once the ten minutes up, I'm gonna add some onion and cook mm. it for another three minutes. But the onion I'm gonna put in is gonna be red onion. Yeah. Decorational purposes. Yeah, for decoration purposes and tomato. <laughs> yeah, that looks yeah. really good. I might reduce some of the water so it's more like a thicker masala. Yeah. Do you want me to leave the lid off? Or no, no, leave it on. Lid? I can reduce it like later yeah. once it's cooked to our taste. Yes, I mean? yes, yes. But yeah, so we'll okay. come back to that, shall we? In how long? In, uh, so we, it's going to be like I said, ten minutes of cooking ten the minutes. chickpeas. You uh. need to, you need to stir. That's his trusted yeah. watch there that he keeps looking Stir at. Stir every couple of minutes, like I said, reduce the water as you need. And the red yeah. onion that you're going to put in, again, it goes last minute, like a minute before yeah. the end. Because you want it to stay crunchy. That's it. And same with the chopped tomatoes. Yeah. Because that just gives it the added niceness and you mix it yeah. in. And, and it tastes really good. I'm sure you guys again the masala. Chana masala. Chana masala, guys. Yeah, chana masala. And... So, yeah. 
I mean, I mean they usually I'm, come with like instructions. I mean, babe, I, well. I told you, didn't I? And it was funny because when I went to the gym yesterday, there was a girl at the reception desk, and I walked up to her and I had my headphones in, so I had my music really loud. So I'm walking in all aggressive. <laughs> I'm ready like, to do oh, some I'm ready to go. I'm ready to go here. <laughs> then I walk in, I'm like, yeah, yeah. And they're like, I thought, let me get my headphones out because it looks like this girl wants to say something to me. So I'm giving her my card and I take my headphone out and she goes, oh, are you, don't get me wrong, are you on YouTube? And I go, <laughs> are you sure yeah, that? okay, yeah, we are. And she goes, oh my God, I see, you guys live in Windsor. And I was like, yeah. And she, I was like, she was like, oh my God, do you know what? I love you guys. Like, you guys are really good. Like, <laughs> she was like, And then she was even like, oh yeah, bring your missus. Has your missus got membership? And I go, no, not really. She goes, don't worry about it. Just bring her in. Oh, really? But, yeah, because obviously she wants to probably like see us together. Yeah, 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 yeah. So it was quite a nice experience to have someone actually say, oh, we've seen your YouTube videos. Oh, that's really girl. nice. And a positive yeah. response as yeah. well. And the girl was basically, it was a positive response. The girl was basically saying that she doesn't uh, watch vlogs normally. Yeah. She watches more. She only, she only watches like makeup stuff. Right. But she saw our video. Okay. And then, uh, it was recommended and, and she goes, she was so glad she did see it. Oh, wicked. Because it really made her think, oh, wow, like... Mixed race relationship and yeah. well, Indian guy with a black girl. That doesn't. What's happen. going on? Yeah. Especially in our area and yeah. in the UK, exactly. it doesn't happen very often. I know in Trinidad and places like that, it's normal apparently. Yeah, but, but over here, it's first know, generation I, I Indians. Know, isn't yeah, it? I know that. But the thing is, yeah. over here, it's and not Indian normal in India. It ain't normal. And I think it's so it good works. when when you guys um, comment and say like, "Oh my God, you've inspired." You've inspired me and yes. you know what, you're making me think of things in a different way. Yeah. It makes like making the vlogs and making the uh, the YouTube channel worth it because like oh, a lot definitely. of goes, a lot of work goes into making the videos. Yeah, it's hard work, man. But when you hear that you're inspiring people, it inspires us and baby, to so want look, to be better, be because isn't it? Because we're quite down to earth, I feel like it's quite emotional for me. Yeah. Like I'm putting all my energy into it and sometimes you can get over emotional and say, one or two things that might end up offending someone, but it's not what you meant to be. You're just trying to be completely passionate, honest. Yeah, exactly. and passionate. I think we're very passionate doing. people. Yeah. Yeah. I think when I'm I very, do something, I can't do it. Yeah. Half when I'm talking about something that yeah. I really care about, I'm very passionate. And I sometimes can't do half it measures. looks. Yeah. Just it looks, like you, though. Yeah. It looks yeah. aggressive, but it's not really. It's not all that. Yeah. Yeah. And and like you said, we're quite tolerant people. Yeah. Otherwise, we could have just <laughs> said everyone can just do one. Yeah. And we don't want anything to do with anyone. No, exactly. Yeah. And that was a nice comment um, when when people watched the uh, the Jubilee Fountain video oh, okay, yeah. when the kids were splashing around. And remember, Ivana was telling Phoenix, "I was saying, I am everybody's I'm sister." Everybody's sister. She's yeah, and this is what we teach the kids: like, look, don't worry about what anyone else thinks. Ivana is funny. Yeah, don't worry about that. We are all connected. She's all a, of she, human beings yeah. are all one. So ha, have, we are have you, sisters. Have you really surprised me? Because she like has a natural sort of yeah, she does. Nature. Yeah, like she shares. You know what? She like reminds that. me of when I was younger. I was exactly like her, and I worry for her because. People might I know what it was like from people taking advantage of me and I'm, I'm gonna like, chuck the coriander in so I've got a bunch of coriander that's for garnishing at the end that I'm gonna chuck in yeah so, so this, I'm gonna put, this is initially this like, greenery is going yeah. in now so say say this is like five minutes into the chickpeas cooking right and then we've got another five minutes or so yeah so we're just gonna mix that in but yeah she's very very caring she's a good girl can you see it's thickening up now the soup so you yeah. didn't even have to take the lid off yeah, that's perfect now yeah. look at that Look how good that looks, the colours. Mm. And guys, if you're not vegetarian, I swear to you, you, you need will. to try this dish. Yeah. Because... You'll convert to vegetarian. <laughs> now, this, this dish, I'm not vegetarian. I don't care about vegetarianism mm. and stuff like that. But this dish is like... I could eat this all the time. Because mm. it tastes so good. The um, Guys, I was just going to say, keep an eye on it, as I said. Because so, if it thickens up too much, you don't want it to burn. No. So as I said, you can just keep adding a little bit of boiling water if you have to. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it doesn't like burn, like burn yeah. basically. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, yeah. But this dish, so this dish is like so yummy, isn't it? Oh, perfect. I'm not vegetarian. I, I can eat this dish all the and, time. And with this, we're going to have like garlic naan bread. Yeah. And I'm going to cut some salad. So tomato... Uh, some salad, red onion, yeah, and some uh, cucumber, yeah. So that's like a Punjabi salad. Mm -hmm. With that, you might have iceberg lettuce, yeah, and also a lot of Indian people like to keep an extra green chili with it, yeah, because they just love it hot. So they're yeah. like biting on that while they're ah. eating with their naan bread and getting their hands all dirty. Yeah, nice. And um, also, we got some Greek yogurt because that goes really well. With Greek yogurt, yeah. But what chick chana masala or Sholle, sholle normally, they're called sholle as well. Mm -hmm. So what they normally go with is a, a, a bread called budure. So right. that, uh, I couldn't spell it in English, I think it's spelled B-H-U-T. 
T O R E or something, but do this some, along that line. Uh -huh. But basically, they like it's like a flour where they make the dough and they make it into like a chapati and then they put it into they deep fat fry it. Oh, right, wow. So it goes into oil, right? Okay. And then it, it basically just swells up, swells up, yeah, and it becomes slightly crispy. But it's still soft. Right. It's soft. It's like a soft chapati that's been right. deep fried. Okay. And basically, when you eat, it's not. It's, I don't know what flour is used, but that is traditionally what goes with that. Right. Okay. That is what you're supposed to eat it with. Right. Okay. And, and but you know, we're just basic. And that's actually. Uh, <laughs> we eat it in all honesty. Like. In all honesty, they used uh, that as a breakfast in India. That's mm. considered a breakfast. Wow. Chana masala and badula. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, they keep. I had it for breakfast when I was in Punjab, off a little wheelie cart stand. Oh, nice. And, and we went early in the My cousin goes, "Look, we've got to go to this stand. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. It's so good, North Punjab. Right. So we've gone to this stand. It's about eight in the morning. So nice. You can hear the birds. It's quiet. The shopping center, the like the shopping area hasn't opened up. Yeah. yeah. But the guys are sitting there, and everyone, quite a few people are there eating around that nice. stand. Nice. So we've got it. I went to my cousin. Whoa, man, this is some good stuff. I was thinking, if this guy could get to England, he could make I a know, killing, kidding, you know what yeah. I mean? But the thing is, who's going to ask an, a, like a poor guy who's just cooking yeah. out of the stand? But sometimes it's mean? not in your destiny. Yeah. That is his destiny. And that's it. That's what he has to accept. That's it. Sometimes so, just not in your destiny. I think that's almost done. So I'm going to add the onions in. Ten minutes are basically up, I think. Okay. So I'm going to add the onions in. We're not going to cook this now for long. Because I want the onions to stay slightly crunchy. So I'm going to just do it for another two minutes. Mm. I'm just going to mix that in. Look how thick that's got. That's going to be so good with naan. Yeah. So you've got that crunchy red onion in there, so the textures are perfect, isn't mm. it? It's yum. I it's funny because it. one of my friends said he saw me on YouTube cooking uh, keema for everyone. <laughs> and he was like, Jazz, man, I saw you on YouTube, man. Oh my God, I'm so he goes, embarrassed. You, 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 no, and, no, no, bro. Yeah, I know. And he goes, you know what? I'm so proud of you. He goes, I love the keema. He goes, you could, his wife was point. so impressed. Yeah. <laughs> like, yeah, he goes there with you like the same to the missus, look. <laughs> that's my boy right there. <laughs> yeah, like, really. I cracked up, I go, brilliant. That's too funny. That's so funny. Yeah, so... It's so funny how people just find you on YouTube like Oh, that. yeah, just yeah, like, yeah. You think just people you don't know are gonna... Look are at gonna, that, look at that, guys, look at that. Are gonna watch you. Yeah, yeah. People, like, it's in funny, day. like, yeah, yeah, people at work saying, Hey, I saw you yeah. on YouTube, I'm like, Because we haven't told this friend, and he saw a video of Prim's life and death thing. Yeah. And he, he's into all that. So yeah. he's like, He oh, was researching it. Oh, Abby's come. No, it's Finn. Oh, it's Finn. Oh. Yes, yes, my darling. Come here. Come over here. I think he wants some. What do you want? Be careful of the light, baby. What do you need, buddy? My granddad got... Uh, no, your cat car has been confiscated right now. Why? Because uh, you keep, uh, I, I think you understand why it has <laughs> been confiscated. <laughs> That's alright. Oh. <laughs> you're, you're, you're very good, boy. You're such a good boy. He is. I'm done with this now, I think, so I'm going to switch this off. Yeah. And I'm going to chuck the final bit of the coriander. Oh, actually, no, I'm not going to chuck the coriander in. I'm going to throw the tomato in. Yeah. So I've switched the gas off, guys. That's one chopped tomato. That's going to go in. Can I see the Yes, my darling. And I'm gonna mix that in. There's a. Yes, yes, baby. Guys, let me know how I've done because I think this looks amazing, man. Um, yeah, I'll get your cat card in a minute, baby. You wait for me. So, like I said, if you want to add more water, you can add it more uh, thicker if you're having it, or like more water, watery if you're having it with rice. Yeah. But we're having it with none. And I'm gonna add the final bit of the coriander. Mm. Sprinkle that in. Look, Look he's all being artistic and Look stuff with it now. I'm lame. -o. You know what I mean? Ah, <laughs> you're brilliant. No. Sorry, guys, I'll cut it on that bit. I'm not a professional yet. Let me just put one there. One there. <laughs> spread it out yeah, evenly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Spread it out not evenly, man. Let the fans see this. Yeah. So, guys, Let our YouTube family see this stuff. Yeah, so, what I'm going to do now, I'm going to leave that to sit for about another 10 minutes. And then we will eat dinner. Yay! What do you think, babe? How does that look? What do you think of my culinary skills? That looks good. Me? I like to taste it. I'll tell you when I taste it. Okay. If yeah, it looks good. They said they, they love us eating the food. <laughs> exactly. Kiddos, are if you it ready to eat the food? When I'm, when I'm tasting it. Are you ready to eat the chana masala, Finn? What's the chana masala? It's very tasty. You know it when you see it. It's the chickpeas. She knows okay. it's yeah. chickpeas. It's chickpeas, honey. Yeah, you like the What's chickpeas. chickpeas? What's a chickpeas? Well, you're a chick. And there's peas in there. <laughs> <laughs> Is that there? Is that there? Is that there? 
<laughs> She's confused. I'll she show knows you in a minute. what chickpeas are. You've okay. eaten them in grandma and granddad's. What are they? Yeah, there you go. That's the little family. Hang okay, on. guys, there's the lovely family. Oh. There's my seeds. There's my seedlings and my wife. <laughs> Say bye to everyone. Say bye bye. Say we'll see you at the dinner table. We'll at the dinner table. And I'll have, I'll have the salad and the naan ready. He's so loud. I want the climb on you. Okay. <laughs> so, Harvey, why do you want to set up the table? Because I just like doing it because it's my favorite thing to do. Is it? Yeah. You're very helpful, you know that. Yes. You're a very good daughter. Thank you very much. So, you're going to yes. put spoons on the table? Yes. For your brother and you? So proud yes. of you. Oh, go on then. Love you, baby. Go for Love it. You. Like a so, that's the next Getting ready. That's daddy's food, mummy's yogurt. How does that look? And yeah. salad. Mommy, no. salad. Mommy. Yes, my darling. Yogurt. And you, you don't want yogurt, it tastes good in there, buddy. There you go. No. Abby, how does yeah. it look, girl? Good. Yeah? Are you excited about eating? Yeah. Who wants to start eating? Go. No. So, I'm going to taste this now. Mm -hmm. And, Abby, is it good for you? Yeah. Yeah. Is it tasty? Okay. I'm gonna dig in. Do you, you like daddy's cooking? Now. You dig in. Do you like daddy's cooking, Abby? Mm -hmm. Let's see what mama says. The wine. <laughs> you know what? Yeah. I would actually say yeah. that this one is it's actually better than the kiva and the chicken. Really? Mm hmm. Guys, it looks good. I'm so I'm I'm I think we've done a good job. Nice yogurt on the side with some salad. Mm. Yeah, it's so good. With naan bread. No, it's so good. Yeah, it's so good. Mm. Like a good. It's like it's like, it's like a restaurant. restaurant. Thing. Are you a foodie, like a Abby? Restaurant. She's a little foodie, isn't it's she? Like, it's like a restaurant. <laughs> <laughs> is it like a restaurant? Is it good? Guys, this is so good. So good. Mm -hmm. This. This stuff. The it's onion is still crunchy. The tomatoes are still nice. It's perfect. Thumbs up. Well done. Good. Well done. I'll be happily married for another couple of weeks, guys. <laughs> How is your dinner? Good. Yeah? Very good. Very good. Fighting. Wow, it's very like good. Cooking? Look. He's eating his dinner well. You're eating your dinner very good, baby. Yeah. Yeah? Do you want to say bye to everyone on YouTube? Bye, everyone. Bye. Bye. Good job, baby boy. Good job. Love you. I love that back home. Mm-hmm.